All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem Yahushah, Ba'ashem Rakaq with us. want to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And this is it, Shalom, taught the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and in sincerity. Um, I'm going to just go into this lesson, man. The earth needs a, a major restart or refresh okay and it's going to happen okay it's going to be a major refreshing okay that that that's going to come okay i'm gonna start off with this scripture um acts 3 and 19 it says repent ye therefore and be converted that your sins may be blotted out when the times of refreshing so come from the presence of the Lord. So when this major refreshing or restart comes, okay, the Lord is going to wipe out everything, man. Everything. Okay? This whole world as we, as we know it, like this way of living, is all going to be done away with. Okay, all things will be uh, new. Okay, but before that happens, there are certain people out here that are going to have the, that chance of being a part of that restarting when that world, um, when this world is uh, done away with. There are certain people that will have that chance of being refreshed. Okay, or uh, be there when this world is restarted. Okay, but those people, before this world is restarted, they have to prove that they're worthy by by converting and and basically restarting themselves. Okay, because those people are called the elect, the chosen. It says and. He shall send Yahawashah, which before was preached unto you, whom the heaven must receive until the times of restitution of all things. Now the word restitution means rest, restoration of a true theocracy. Or theocracy of the perfect state before the fall okay of the perfect state before the fall now this says the restitution of all things everything okay from the very beginning of the earth okay the Lord didn't make men, okay, for, for for us to die. That wasn't that wasn't uh in his plans. His plans was for us to live forever, like him. Okay? That was that was when when men were perfect. Okay? Now we're not perfect. We have to get back. And through that state before we fell. Or want or want to get back into that state before we fell. Okay? And that, we took a, a very, very, very fall steep fall, man. Okay. The fact that you know the, the, the state that we're in right now, where our bodies are are, are hurting. Okay? Like for example, you know, I used to, you know, not too long ago, thought that I could see really good, thought that my eyes was, you know, awesome. So I went for a test and I found out that I need to, you know, wear glasses when I drive. Now all of a sudden I'm wearing glasses and it's hard as I don't know what to see, um, 
without uh, driving, well, with my glasses on. I mean, I can see a little bit here and there, but the fact is that my eyesight used to be good. But the Lord is going to restore even your eyesight, man. Okay? Everything is going to be restored. We're going to be perfect, man. Ain't going to be no going off. Like I said, you look at the condition that our people are in. You have this um, thing called the Willie Lynch Syndrome. That's that's taking a major effect on our people. But the, the curses that are in the Bible, how low our people are. We can't agree on anything. Okay? Where our people, before we fell, we was doing what the Lord said. We was perfect. I'm talking about, you know, during the, 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 the time of... Uh, the Garden of the um, Garden of Eden. Okay, it says, "Whom the heaven must receive until the times of restitution of all things." Okay, when things was perfect, which God has spoken by the mouth of all His prophets since the world began. So this plan that the earth was going to get a major restart was was. Uh, being spoken before the world began okay it says um for Moses truly said unto the fathers a prophet so shall the Lord your God raise up unto you of your brethren like unto me him shall you hear in all things whatsoever he shall say unto you okay and it shall come to pass that every soul which will not hear that prophet shall be destroyed from among the people. Yeah, and all the prophets from Samuel and those that follow after, as many as have spoken, have likewise foretold of the of, of these days. You are the children of the prophets and of the covenant which God made with our fathers, saying unto Abraham, and in your seed shall all the kindreds of the earth be blessed. Okay, now right here it says whoever don't want to listen to that that uh or, or hear that prophet, they're gonna be destroyed from among the people. So with that that refreshing that's about to come, a lot of these people that 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 don't want to listen, they're considered two thirds, so they're gonna to have to be destroyed. But then guess what? They're gonna come back and they're gonna be restarted. Okay. When this earth is, is uh, restarted. They're going to come back as the men of the Lord's children. So. Um, when the Lord returns. Okay. This is Acts 1 and 11. Which also said. Ye men of Galilee. Why stand ye up gazing into heaven. This same Yahweh Which is taken up from you into heaven. So. So come in like manner. As you have seen him go into heaven. So the same way you see him go into heaven. Is the same way he's going to come back. Okay. He's going to restart this earth. Okay. But like I said. Before this earth is restarted. There has to be order. Here first. For those people that. Were. That, that will be. Um. Uh part of that re restarting Isaiah 1 and 26 and I will restore your judges as at the first and your counselors as at the beginning afterward you shall be called the city of righteousness the faithful city Zion shall be redeemed with judgment and her converts with righteousness so once again, those those converts are the people that repented and came back. Okay, that refreshed themselves before the Lord refreshed them. Okay, because when you don't want the Lord to to to, to, to you know when He comes back to refresh you, because guess what, you're going to get that destruction, man. Okay, it says, and the destruction of the transgressors and of the sinners shall be together. And they that forsake the Lord shall be consumed. Okay? And it's clear as day. 
First John 3 and 1. Behold what manner of love the Father has bestowed upon us that we should be called the sons of God. Therefore the world knows us not because it knew him not. Okay, so the ones who can't see what's going on, you don't know the Father. Okay? Because the Lord is, is building or getting his people right, right before your eyes. Beloved, now are we the sons of God, and it does not yet appear what we shall be, but we know that when he shall appear, we shall be like him, for we shall see him as he is. And a lot of people ain't going to see the Lord as, as, as he is when he comes back. Okay, first off, a lot of people are looking for a white man to come back. They're not in the truth. See, we know Yahawashah means he delivers or he saves. And when he comes back, okay, <laughs> Lord willing, we are those, those, those people, the sons of God, the elect. And when he comes back, we're going to see him as, as the deliverer. Okay? That's how we're going to see him. But a lot of a lot of people out here, they're not going to be able to see him like that. They're going to see him as the destroyer. The destroyer of the Gentiles. Okay? Because that's who they are. They, they're heathens. Okay? So it says, And every man that has this hope in him purifies himself. Okay? Even as he is pure. So you're gonna purify yourself, man, if you really believe this 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 truth, this word. Okay? You're gonna restart yourself. It says uh to make pure, to cleanse. You're gonna cleanse yourself, man. Okay? That's that uh baptism, which is you know through the word. Okay? Jeremiah four and seven. This is what this is what these people are gonna gonna see. Okay? First he came as a lamb, now he's coming back as a as a lion, man. Okay. It says Jeremiah 4 and 7. The lion is come up from his thicket, and the destroyer of the Gentiles is on his way. He has gone forth from his place to make thy land desolate, and thy city shall be laid waste without an inhabitant. For this gird you with sackcloth, lament, and howl. For the fierce anger of the Lord is not turned back from us. And we hope, man, that 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 we're saved during that time of that refreshing. Okay? Because everything, okay, is going to be uh, restarted, man. Okay? put back into the times that it was before okay before before the fall okay before this dystopia that we live in now okay so with that man I want to say Salawam